Welcome to Tips for Life. In this video, the do's and don'ts for a healthy liver. Liver is one of the most important organs of the body. It performs many vital functions, like metabolizing fat and alcohol, regulating the amount of fat, protein and carbohydrates in the body, storing essential vitamins and minerals, fighting infections, removing toxins from the body, and so on. As such, this organ deserves extra good care, for your long and healthy life. Without good lifestyle, enough physical activity, and a healthy diet, the liver undergoes a lot of stress, and other problems and diseases. So, how should you take care of your liver? Here are important do's and don'ts, for a healthy liver. But before we begin, if you are new to this channel, click the subscribe button, to join us, and also the notification bell, so you get notified, every time we upload a new video, alright, so, here we go. Firstly, the do's. 1. Drink enough water. Drinking water, removes any waste in the body, and is good for transportation of essential nutrients, throughout the body. If you don't drink enough water, your liver struggles to remove the toxins in your body, and to filter blood. So, always stay well hydrated, so that your liver can function properly. Taking water with you, as you go out, is a good practice, as it will remind you, that you need to have a drink. 2. Consume more leafy green veggies. Here, the general principle is, the greener the vegetables on your plate, the better it is for your liver. These vegetables, have cleansing compounds, that naturally clean your liver. 3. Add more garlic and turmeric to your diet. Garlic, is great for your liver, as it has a lysine and selenium, which both work to cleanse your liver. It also contains sulfur compounds, which activate liver enzymes which are responsible for flushing out any toxins in your body. Besides being one of the best healing spices, turmeric is also great for a healthy liver. It protects the liver against toxic damage, boosts bile, and helps in regeneration of liver cells. 4. Include organic oils in your food. For the health of your liver, include more good fats to your diet. Prepare your salads, and cook your food, with good organic fats like olive oil, walnuts, avocados, and so on. These oils, are good cleansers for the liver. In particular, walnuts contain high levels of iodine, which helps detoxify the liver, and keeps the blood flowing. However, avoid seed-based oils, like corn oil, soybean oil, safflower oil, vegetable oil, sunflower oil, canola oil, which are high in omega-6 polyunsaturated fatty acids. So, when buying products, check labels to see what oils are used. 5. Eat more fruits. In particular, go for vitamin C fruits, like citrus fruits, lemons and oranges, as they help to remove toxins from your body and heal a fatty liver. Drinking fresh lemon juice every day, and adding lemon to your cooking, give your liver an added boost. Apples and grapefruits, are also great. Both contain nutrients, which are ideal for optimal liver function. Apples, contain nutrients which help to release toxins and clean the body. Grapefruit, is full of antioxidants, which also help the liver clean the body. Grapefruit juice, is also good, as it helps to boost the liver's detoxification enzymes. 6. Drink green tea. Green tea, eliminates liver fat, and ensures the liver is functioning properly. It also protects the liver against toxins, which can cause harm to your body. Besides helping your liver, Green tea is also great for weight loss, because it has no calories. So, drink it often if you want to stay healthy. 7. 
befriend organic foods. Yes, organic foods have fewer chemicals that your liver has to work on and remove from your body. They also have no added hormones or antibiotics. By eating organic foods, you also avoid pesticides and other synthetic chemicals, which place a heavy burden on your liver. 8. Drink coffee in moderation. Yes, drinking coffee daily and moderately can help prevent you from getting liver disease. Studies show that drinking two cups of coffee a day can reduce your risk of getting cirrhosis by up to 43%. So, also consider drinking coffee on a daily basis to help prevent your liver from getting this disease. However, avoid putting in much sugar and also stick to black coffee with non-dairy milk to ensure that you stay healthy while protecting your liver. 9. Exercise regularly. Exercise is also good for your liver. Do at least 20 minutes of exercise every day to help you to keep your body functioning properly and at an optimal weight. This will in the end have a positive impact on your liver. If you are enjoying this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Secondly, the don'ts. 1. Don't overindulge in fatty, salty, and sugary foods. Bear in mind that fatty and fried foods are not liver friendly. Eating too many salty foods, like fries, and too many sugary foods, like candies and colas, is also bad for the liver. So, for the health of your liver, be smart and avoid overindulgence in such foods. 2. Don't consume processed foods often. Processed foods are full of many ingredients and chemicals, including mad fats and oils, that are unhealthy for your body, let alone your liver. So, always read the label of any processed food you buy, so you know exactly what is in the product. In general, it is good to avoid processed foods, which are low-fat, or 99% fat-free. Why? Because such foods are often made palatable by removing the fat and sugar, but are harder for your liver to process. 3. Don't drink alcohol excessively. Alcohol is one of the main causes for fatty liver, liver diseases, and cirrhosis. You see, consuming too much alcohol can cause damage to your liver cells and reduce the liver's ability to remove toxins from your body. So, sticking to the recommended daily amounts, that is, one glass per day for women, and two for men, or abstaining completely, is good for your health. If you feel like you are developing a problem with alcohol, do not hesitate to consult a doctor, or seek some help. 4. Don't overuse painkillers. To keep your liver healthy, also make sure to avoid prolonged use of painkillers in your life. Bear in mind that taking too many painkillers makes your liver struggle to remove toxins from your body. Also, the acetaminophen found in painkillers can cause liver failure if you are taking too many pills. So, make sure you are only using painkillers while your body needs it only stick to the recommended dosage that your doctor suggests. In case you are struggling to come off the drugs, consult a doctor without delay. Do you have any tips to add to the list? If you do, feel free to add them in the comments section below. Finally, if you find value in this video, like the video, and remember to subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you get notified of new uploaded videos on this channel. Thank you, for watching.